Welcome to the 2018-19 NCAA Men's Basketball Weekly Whistle, video number four. This is J.D. Collins, the NCAA National Coordinator of Men's Basketball Officiating. As a reminder, officials have been directed to continue our efforts to reduce physicality to create freedom of movement. In addition, the Rules Committee directed officials to be diligent in calling the rules as written. Additional focus will be given to traveling, the elimination of the hook and hold play, screen and roll plays, and the consistent enforcement of bench decorum, the coaching box, and unsporting conduct rules. This video will highlight the difference between an obvious hook and hold play and normal entanglement during the course of the game. This play depicts the essence of a hook and hold flagrant foul. Number 55 green and number 41 white block out during a try. Number 41 white hooks his left arm under the right arm of number 55 green and then holds or clamps the arm of number 55 green to keep him from obtaining the rebound. The lead official immediately calls a flagrant one foul on number 41 white for hooking and holding. Without the clamp by number 41 white, this likely would have been ruled a common foul on number 41 white. Number two white and number four blue block out during a try. Number four blue hooks his left arm under the right arm of number two white and then holds or clamps the arm of number two white to keep him from obtaining the rebound. The lead official calls a common foul on number four blue for holding during the rebound. After reviewing the monitor, the common foul on number four blue is correctly upgraded to a flagrant one foul. This play depicts the type of play that the rules committee wants removed from our game. During this free throw rebound, number 24 gray holds the left arm of number two green. Number 24 gray does not hook or clamp the arm of number two green. This play was incorrectly ruled a hook and hold flagrant one foul on number 24 gray. This play should have been ruled a common foul on number 24 gray. Officials have been instructed not to be overzealous with looking for hook and hold plays. Officials calling the obvious hook and holds will make the game better. Number 20 gray post up in the lane and number 15 white defends the play. As the play develops, number 15 white briefly holds the left arm of number 20 gray. This action by number 15 white was a normal part of defending a post up. This is not a hook and hold play. In fact, this is an incidental contact play and should not have been called a foul. Officials have been instructed not to be overzealous with looking for hook and hold plays. Officials calling the obvious hook and holds will make the game better. This is a great time of year for everyone that loves college basketball. I hope this weekly whistle helps inform and educate everyone about the rules of the game. Thank you for your interest in college basketball.